PG&E has chosen one Bay Area city to test cutting-edge wildfire prevention technology for the first time in North America. The utility learned about these sensors after they proved successful in Australia. KBIX 5's Don Ford reports from Calistoga to show us how the technology works. It may look like a substation, but it's actually part laboratory. PG&E is evaluating technology from around the world, hoping to make their system safer. Extreme weather combined with downed power lines has burned many parts of California. Here in Calistoga, PG&E is testing a special automated safety system from Australia, the Rapid Earth Fault Current Limiter, or REFCUF. And this technology allows us to lower the current or the amount of energy in a line when it detects that line has gone down. PG&E says the action is automated and near instantaneous, so the power line isn't lying there energized, starting fires. This is one of the sensor packages, a control box that monitors the lines coupled with antennas. They trip special insulated switches to isolate small sections of the grid instead of the entire circuit a scalpel instead of an ax. We will be testing over the next several weeks, and depending on those tests, we'll be able to decide if we want to keep this technology here in Calistoga. Another system is from the Texas A&M University. PG&E is sending radio signals down energized lines and measuring the return signals. They say this system tells them the health of the lines and even if a single strand is broken. Calistoga Mayor Chris Kenny welcomes the research. You're okay Not being a laboratory. We are absolutely. Some people have referred to it as a guinea pig. We don't. I don't call it that. You know, we're the trailblazer, <laughs> if you will. In Calistoga, Don Ford, KPIX Five. Now at six on KPIX Five and streaming on CBSN Bay Area, a San Jose church continues to defy health orders.